Christ and a uh, musician and physicist. Uh, and I go to violin, I'm a singer, I'm a songwriter. Uh, I've been developing um, sonic son installations and, and sound installations recently using um, spiking neurons and neuronal networks to trigger, trigger sounds. I'm a lecturer at the University of Plymouth, lecturer in sonic arts, and um, I have various different things that I do. Pretty, I've got a pretty broad, pretty broad approach. Um, most recently, I was working <clears throat> on a project called the Fragmented Orchestra with Jane Grant and Nick Ryan, and I've also released an album recently on the counter of the Ninja Tune label called Stories from the Water Cooler. And a few years ago, I released an album called Small Town Shining on the Accidental Records. And both those albums are songwriting albums, albums of songs. Um, and I also released with Nick Ryan an album called Cortical Songs um, in 2008. And that was released in the States in 2009. And that is a, a piece for solo violin. I'm a violinist and string orchestra. And the, the cortical songs work and the fragmented orchestra work um, are both um, extensions of some work we've been doing at the University of Plymouth. Looking at, um, it's a kind of neuroengineering really, and it's a way of looking at the way in which uh, um, the rhythms of the nervous system can be applied to sound. So the, the a neuron is quite an interesting object. It's quite a simple object on its own if you look at it um, in a coarse grain kind of way. Um, and you can view it theoretically as, an, an, as, an, as, a, as a cell which sends a very short, about sort of five millisecond duration spike to all its connected neighbors when the voltage on its membrane exceeds a certain threshold. Now, if you imagine that there's a certain topology of connections of neurons and they're all sending messages to each other there's a kind of complex system of sending and receiving which results in um, rhythmic firing that has very interesting rhythms that are kind of commensurate with the rhythms that we might find interesting musically so what we've been doing is we've been experimenting with transferring the, the rhythms of the firing into musical sounds so sometimes the, the musical sounds will be tiny little grains um, which are recorded in real time, they're, they're triggered in real time I should say. And the Fragmented Orchestra project was a project based around the internet and a distributed project where we had 24 sites um, all around the UK from football stadia and um, rugby stadia through to primary schools, art galleries um, and in each of these locations was a computer and a microphone and a Fionic, which is a piezo speaker. And sound was collected from all these sites and sent to the Fact Gallery in Liverpool. And in the gallery was a computer server which um, took all the audio coming in from the internet. And each one, each channel was triggering uh, one of these artificial neurons. And the neurons formed a tiny cortex. Um, which were triggered, which triggered each other and were triggered by the incoming sounds. Now when um, one of the neurons in the cortex fired, it sent the sound from that side to a speaker that was hanging in the gallery. And you could hear, the, 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 one, of the, one of the ideas of the piece was the fact that the, the sound from that, uh, an incoming sound or a sound made by that speaker would then trigger a cascade of sounds across the um, hanging, 24 hanging speakers in, in the gallery. Um, it was in, exhibited in the Ding Long show from December 2008 until the end of February 2009. And we hope to um, recreate and extend this project in various different cities and across the, across the world in the next few years. Mm.